bit of an over exaggeration, but not really with the top players. Let's do one up, one back. Being able to get down and move your feet. No, move back to service line. Do one up, one back. Three up, three back. I'm sorry. Three up, three back. Good. Balance. A little off balance there as, as he moves back. Last one. Little off balance, but not bad. It's really important as you're moving back to be able to have a perfect split. And then if somebody smashes the ball at you, you pop out of your split and go get the ball. But you only can if you're in perfect balance. Hope you guys have a great day. See you soon. That was a beautiful motion there. That was a beautiful motion. Very simple. Not trying to overdo it, not trying to overhit it. Letting your centrifugal force flow with your arm being a whip. Okay, now all top spin kick. Really feel with the uh, the serve if Grady gets a good rhythm and good feel. You know, it's awfully nice to not have to worry about your serve because you can feel good about placing it and be able to place it on a dime. It sure makes the, the second shot a lot easier. It's even better if you don't have to play a second shot. But he's getting to the point now to where he can hit aces. He's, he can uh, hit his spots and then be able to progress on the point from there, approach shots and, and attacking game, or stay back, both. So just a few more topspin kick serves, and we're gonna do some off the board. Okay, now we're off the board. That was better balance, nice job. Good. So are coming, Grady. Hitting up. Then releasing down, using that core as much as possible on the, the downward. That's what I used to feel. I'd get up on top of the ball, right at the tip of the ball, hit up slightly, and then use my core just a little bit to release. And the more I'd work on my core, the bigger my serve got. Wow, you're starting to pop some. Looks good. Like it. No, 
I like what you're doing there. You're just slowing it down, slowing it down. The real hard part of those was sometimes when we get our body wound up and then get that ball up there, it's just not quite in the right spot. And see, you're just simplifying it by doing that. It sometimes makes it easier. As a matter of fact, Jay Berger, who was one of the best United States players in the day, he's now a national coach, I believe, for the USTA. He serves like that. He serves by starting right there. He used to serve by starting there. How'd that feel? Better. Yeah, that was pretty good. How's that wrist? Feel pretty floppy loose. and loose? Yeah. yeah, it looks like it on that one. That looks pretty good in general too. So is this one of the first times since you've served since uh, Virginia? No, uh, it's like the third time. Well, it was the altitude there. Red target. Think about that a little bit. Letting it drop and then brushing up. Let's get that toss just a tad more over your head too. There you go. Let's do one more round of that. <laughs> 